discovery of another possible Earth-like planet that's grabbing worldwide attention today. It's true, scientists have previously said they believe there are other planets outside our solar system that resemble Earth in size and may have liquid water. But this latest finding is the closest planet yet found. Yes, it's four light years from Earth, just a mere 25 trillion miles away, but travel there may be possible by the end of the century. Uh, the planet is called Proxima b, circling a small star called Proxima Centauri, as shown in this animation. It's thought to be about 1.3 times the mass of Earth, probably rocky like the Earth, and possibly warm enough for liquid water. Let's uh, it is tidally locked, which means there is a light side always and a dark side always. So I suppose the real estate on the light side might be better. I don't know. If you're a night owl, maybe you want to go to the other side. Uh, it's very close to its star, but the star itself is a brown dwarf. It's a pretty wimpy star, and so it can be closer and be in what scientists call the Goldilocks zone, the just right zone where the temperatures are just right for uh, water to exist in liquid form. And here's the thing to remember, wherever we look on this planet, no matter where we go, deep down in the ocean, in acid springs in Yellowstone, if there's liquid water, we find life. The James Webb Telescope has uncovered something terrifying about Proxima b. It's being destroyed by deadly radiation storms from its own star. This small planet, only four light years away, was once thought to be a possible home for life. But new images show a nightmare scenario where life could never survive. Could this shocking discovery change everything we know about the universe? Let us explore the haunting truth that is bringing the human race to the brink of its collapse. The red dwarf that could change everything. Proxima b's unique characteristics have long intrigued astronomers. The planet is tidally locked meaning one side always faces its star, enduring perpetual daylight, while the other remains in eternal darkness. Early theories speculated that an advanced civilization could exist there, utilizing technologies to distribute energy between the two sides. However, signals captured by the James Webb Telescope have shifted this idea from exciting to chilling. These faint but irregular light emissions from the planet's dark side resemble artificial light, the kind generated by intelligent beings. Yet, these lights don't align with any natural phenomena, making scientists question who or what might be responsible. Before we dive deeper, it's clear these strange lights might not be a sign of hope, but something far more sinister, something we may not be ready to face. To add to the problem, Proxima b's red dwarf star is notorious for violent solar flares. These eruptions can strip away a planet's atmosphere and flood its surface with radiation, making life as we know it nearly impossible. If life exists under such conditions, it must have evolved in ways we can barely imagine. The disturbing possibility arises. Could such a civilization view Earth as a lush haven in comparison to their own hostile environment? And if they possess technology capable of thriving in such extremes, how might they perceive us? The intrigue doesn't stop there. In 2021, a narrow band radio signal, startlingly similar to those used in Earth's communication systems, was detected coming from Proxima b. This wasn't random noise. The signal had a distinct frequency suggesting an artificial origin. Even more unsettling, it wasn't a one-time occurrence. Patterns in the signal have led some to speculate that it's an attempt at contact. But the burning question remains, is this a friendly hello or something far more sinister? Scientists analyzing these findings are walking a fine line between hope and caution. If Proxima b harbors advanced life, it could mean a society capable of incredible feats. But it could also mean they've noticed us too. History shows us that encounters between civilizations often don't go well for the less advanced party. Could we be inviting disaster by continuing to observe and send signals into space? Meanwhile, researchers are delving deeper into Proxima b's atmospheric composition, searching for biosignatures, chemical signs of life. Using the unparalleled sensitivity of the James Webb Telescope, astronomers 
are separating natural phenomena from potential artificial emissions. Gases like methane, carbon dioxide, and water vapor are being analyzed, with each discovery providing more pieces to a daunting problem. Still, these efforts are fraught with challenges, as interpreting data from over four light years away leaves plenty of room for error. Proxima B's discoveries highlight a broader shift in the search for extraterrestrial life. It's no longer just about curiosity. It's about preparing for the unknown. The prospect of encountering advanced life brings with it questions that could redefine humanity's place in the cosmos. How would we react? Would we unite? Or would these revelations deepen existing divides on Earth? And most importantly, should we even try to make contact? As unsettling as the implications of Proxima B are, they're part of a much larger exploration of the universe. The James Webb Space Telescope has given us unprecedented access to distant worlds, opening doors to discoveries we're only beginning to comprehend. Yet, with every answer comes a slew of new questions. For instance, what if Proxima B's light emissions and radio signals aren't signs of life, but instead remnants of a long-dead civilization? Or worse, could they be trapped set by something far more advanced and dangerous? The signals from Proxima B are just one part of a bigger story, where hidden forces shape the universe in ways we don't fully understand. It sounds like a plot from a sci-fi movie, but some serious scientists believe it's possible. The catch? We're stuck in this universe with no way to peek into the others. Without evidence, the multiverse feels like a cosmic daydream, an idea too tantalizing to ignore but too slippery to prove. Time, that relentless ticking force, is another mind-bender. We're used to time moving forward, but some theories suggest it might not be so straightforward. Could time loop or bend in ways we can't imagine? Time travel, at least in theory, isn't completely off the table. But if that's true, where are all the time travelers? The idea that time could be more flexible than we think is both exciting and a bit unsettling. Maybe we'll never fully understand it, or maybe we're just asking the wrong questions. Then there's the age-old question of life beyond Earth. With billions of galaxies, each packed with stars and planets, it seems impossible that we're alone. Yet, despite all our efforts, no alien civilizations have shown up to say hello. Missions to Mars, probes scanning distant moons, and telescopes searching for habitable planets haven't given us a clear answer yet. Is life rare, or are we just looking in the wrong places? The silence is deafening, but it doesn't stop us from imagining who or what might be out there. Black holes add yet another layer of cosmic drama. These gravitational monsters suck in everything around them, even light, making them the ultimate cosmic traps. What happens to stuff that falls in? Does it get destroyed, or does it go somewhere else entirely? Theories range from spaghettification, stretching matter into thin strands, to possible portals to other dimensions. Images of black holes captured by telescopes have brought us closer to understanding them, but so much remains unknown. They're both terrifying and fascinating, like nature's ultimate dare. And what about the elements that make up the universe? Scientists have a pretty good grasp of what stars and planets are made of, but there are some glaring discrepancies. Take lithium, for example. Observations show less of it than theoretical models predict. This lithium problem is like a loose thread in the fabric of the universe, hinting that something about our understanding is off. It's a small problem, but solving it could lead to bigger revelations. Galaxy formation is another head-scratcher. We have models that explain how galaxies come together, but they're not perfect. What role does dark matter play in shaping galaxies? Why do some galaxies spiral gracefully, while others look like chaotic blobs? Every new discovery raises more questions, turning what seems like progress into a deeper rabbit hole. The more we learn, the more we realize how much we don't know. The early universe, seen through the faint glow of the cosmic microwave background, holds many secrets. This radiation is like an ancient snapshot of the universe shortly after the Big Bang. But how did the first stars and galaxies emerge from that hot, dense soup? The physics of those early moments is still murky, 
and every new observation adds to the list of things we don't understand. It's a cosmic detective story with no clear culprit in sight, from the pull of gravity to the first light of the universe. There are forces shaping everything that we're only starting to understand, searching for a theory that ties it all together, gravity. The force we all take for granted is surprisingly strange. On large scales, it's the glue that holds the universe together. But on tiny scales, like inside atoms, it doesn't play well with other forces. Scientists are desperate to figure out how gravity fits into the grand scheme of things, but so far, it's like trying to solve a jigsaw puzzle with missing pieces. Cracking the code on gravity could lead to breakthroughs we can't even imagine. Then there's the idea of extra dimensions. What if there's more to space than the three dimensions we experience? Some theories suggest that hidden dimensions could explain fundamental forces like gravity. But proving their existence is a whole other challenge. If they're real, these extra dimensions could completely change how we understand the universe. For now, though, they're as elusive as ever. Neutrinos, tiny particles that barely interact with matter, are another question. They're everywhere, yet almost impossible to study. These ghost-like particles hold clues about the early universe and the fundamental laws of physics. Unlocking their questions could open new doors, but it's like trying to catch shadows in the dark. Quantum mechanics the study of the tiniest building blocks of the universe is both mind-blowing and baffling. Wave-particle duality, where particles act like waves and vice versa, is just one of its strange quirks. Then there's the infamous observer effect, where simply watching a particle can change its behavior. It's like the universe has a hidden rule book we've only just started to skim through. Quantum mechanics has revolutionized technology, but its deeper problems remain unsolved. Cosmic rays, high-energy particles zipping through space, also defy easy explanations. Some come from the sun, but others arrive with such immense energy that their origins are a question. Are they born in supernovae, black holes, or something even more exotic? Understanding cosmic rays could reveal new physics, but for now, they're just another unsolved riddle. The dream of a unified theory, one set of rules to explain all forces in the universe, is like the holy grail of physics. Right now, we have separate theories for gravity, electromagnetism, and quantum mechanics, but they don't mesh well together. A unified theory would tie everything together in a neat package, but finding it has proven incredibly difficult. It's like searching for a single key in a universe-sized haystack. The large-scale structure of the universe is another wonder. Galaxies aren't scattered randomly. They form a web-like pattern that stretches across billions of light years. How did this structure come to be? Understanding it could shed light on the forces that shape the cosmos, but it's a problem we're far from solving. Black hole singularities, the points of infinite density at their centers, break all the rules of physics. What really happens at these extreme points? Do they hold the key to understanding the universe's most fundamental laws? The answers remain locked away, hidden by the event horizons of these strange objects. Exoplanets or planets orbiting stars outside our solar system are another frontier. Thousands have been discovered, but we barely scratch the surface of what's out there. What are these worlds like? Could any of them support life? The hunt for exoplanets is thrilling, but it's also a reminder of how little we know about our cosmic neighborhood. Faster than light travel is a staple of science fiction, but could it ever be real? Wormholes, warp drives, and other theoretical concepts suggest it might be possible, but our current understanding of physics says no. Still, the idea of breaking the ultimate speed limit keeps us dreaming about what lies beyond our reach. The cosmic microwave background a faint glow left over from the Big Bang is like the universe's baby picture. Studying it has revealed a lot, but there are still unexplained anomalies in its temperature. These quirks could hold important clues about the universe's early moments, but for now, they're another unsolved question. Time asymmetry or the arrow of time is another head-scratcher. The laws of physics mostly work the same forwards and backwards, Yet we experience time moving in one direction. Why is that? 
Understanding time's one-way flow could reveal deeper truths about the universe, but it's a question that continues to stump scientists. High-energy phenomena like gamma-ray bursts and quasars are some of the universe's most dramatic events. These cosmic fireworks release unimaginable amounts of energy, but their origins and mechanisms are still being unraveled. Each discovery adds another layer to our understanding, but also more questions. Life in extreme environments on Earth, like deep sea vents or acidic lakes, shows how adaptable life can be. These discoveries hint that life might survive in similar conditions on other planets or moons, but proving it is another story. The search for extraterrestrial life is one of the most exciting scientific pursuits, even if the answers remain elusive. Finally, planetary formation, how worlds like Earth come to be, is another captivating topic. We have models, but they're incomplete. Gas giants, rocky planets, and moons all form in different ways, and the details are still being worked out. Understanding how planets form could help us make sense of our own origins, but it's a long and winding road. The universe is a playground of unanswered questions, each one more fascinating than the last. Every discovery feels like a new breadcrumb on a trail that stretches endlessly ahead. We may never have all the answers, but the pursuit itself is what makes the path worthwhile. Is Proxima be a doomed world by chance, or could it be a warning of what's to come for Earth? Tell us your thoughts, and remember to like and subscribe for more.